Hi, I'm Lynn and I'm learning to golf at Douglas Park in Mogai. Um, well, I'm, I'm about to retire in October this year and I thought that me and my husband, uh, who's already retired in the house together, would not be a good idea. Um, so um, he's already in retirement mode and I'm not. And so he's taking up bowls and I'm taking up golf. That's what we decided. Um, a friend told me about Douglas Park, they did a get into golf thing. And um, we came along on the open day that they had. Um, and it couldn't have been any better organised. They had loads of people, ladies on. Um, I got shown around the clubhouse. I got taken around the course by the head greenkeeper and his golf caddy. Um, felt very welcoming. Douglas Park are doing it, it's £306 for the year, but that includes 10 hours of tuition with a professional and I thought I'm going to need a lot of guidance and I thought that's a good buy really for me. It's perfect actually and at least after a year I'll know whether I like it or not. The other thing at Douglas Park they do is they have blue tees about halfway up the fairway so it's, I think it's to encourage you, um, A it's not so daunting starting from the main tees but B there's less chance of you holding other people up and you're basically going at the same pace as they are. So it's, it's, it's more relaxing for you to be there. Um, and the other thing that I think they do is they put you on a WhatsApp group, uh, all the beginners together. Um, and it makes you, you don't, it's not just you joining the club then on your own. You have lots of friends who are in the same position with the same fears. And um, even when the lessons, the last lessons tomorrow night after that, we're still going to go out whoever's available on the Thursday night will go out as a group and um, keep practicing. Well, I've not done the whole 18 yet. Um, I'm working up to it. <laughs> so far, the maximum I've done is nine. Um, but I mean, you could just go out and do three or four holes and then and come back in. You know, you don't need to do the whole thing. You know, at Douglas Park here, the first 11 holes are on the flat and then there's a hill uh, on the, I think it's the 11th or 12th. And I've never done that one yet. In fact, it's the 12th a hill. So I've yet to go up to that part of the, of the course, but um, I like the flat bit. <laughs> um, it's, just, it's, it's gradual, you know. Um, I don't want to overdo it. I'm just learning gradually, you know. I mean, I have just started. It. It's a total learning curve. I mean, I still swing and miss the ball completely. Or instead of hitting it straight, it goes flying off to the right, you know. But, um, but I'm enjoying it, you know. Oh yeah, the, the other people that have started are lovely actually. There's a lot of single women have joined the WhatsApp group um, and come along. I think their husbands have probably been playing for years and they've just decided I'm doing it too. I mean, I'm, I'm doing this because I'm retiring. Um, um, but I mean, I think it's just a nice thing to do, but at any age, never mind. I actually wish I'd done it years ago. My father was a golfer. I remember years ago dropping him off here when I was 17 in the car for him to come and play golf. And I wish I'd started it then, you know. So, I mean, I know that my father was a golfer and I thought, I'll, I'll give it a go. I'm, I'm still very early stages, I'm learning, but I'm really enjoying it. And, and, I'm, and I can see myself in the future being addicted to it, right? I can also see how it can be quite frustrating in that you can have a good day and a bad day. Um, but uh, no, I'm quite enjoying it. And, and I think it's definitely worth, I'm, I'm going to be doing it a long time, I think.